five. Now here's today tonight and robots will play a role in treating patients at the new Perth Children's Hospital, Monica. Sam, the opening of the new hospital may have been delayed, but inside they're trialling some of the most advanced technology in the world. Chantelle Tui was given exclusive access to the $1.2 billion building's pharmacy that's almost fully automated. <laughs> More efficient, we deliver our medications faster and most importantly it's much, much safer. We remove a lot of the risk of the selecting the wrong medication which is quite a significant risk in hospitals. Welcome to the future of hospitals. Robots that sort and choose the right drugs after they've been prescribed to patients. A tubing system that shoots medication along the ceiling. This is behind the scenes at Perth Children's Hospital's robot-run pharmacy. It's very, very futuristic. Um, this is the most automated pharmacy in Australia at the moment. Christopher Hopps is the chief pharmacist at Princess Margaret Hospital. He says the new pharmacy at Perth Children's Hospital is as high-tech as they come. The shoots um, that come from our whole pack robot go through to our, to our dispensary and they supply medications uh, through, almost through the ceiling to the spirals in the outpatient pharmacy and our robot will then go and pick the medication, put it in, in a box for delivery uh, to the ward. The engine room of the pharmacy is a labyrinth of machines that store and sort all of the medication needed for patients and outpatients. When it comes to medication in hospitals, one of the biggest concerns is that patients will be given the wrong dose or even the wrong medication altogether. Perth Children's Hospital says this robot-led system makes it much safer for patients. Quite a significant increase in medication safety. Jess Hosking is in charge of the technical side of the operation. She says the system, which has been used extensively overseas, has been shown to significantly reduce dangerous mistakes. We remove a lot of the risk of the selecting the wrong medication, which is quite a significant risk in hospitals, particularly have big long drug names. They all sound the same, they all look the same. So by being taken to a particular drug with their flashing light and there's also alerts if they access the wrong one accidentally. Here's how it works. This robot stores thousands of packets of medications. It sorts them, keeps a check on inventory and expiry dates. And when orders come through, it dispenses them either through the overhead tubing system or into containers that are taken to the ward and locked in a secure cabinet. It works quite quickly, so it's much more efficient than a, a technician or another pharmacy staff member having to pick the stock. It's also much safer because we barcode scan all the items in, uh, so we know that the item we are getting is the item that we've asked for. This machine is what they call the unit dose robot. It prepares single doses of medication for children and barcodes them to ensure the young patients get the exact dose of the right medication. The idea is that every dose is recorded and tracked to ensure nothing goes wrong. We know that uh, in Australia, 20% of healthcare related errors are associated with medication. And something that we're striving to achieve here is to improve that and provide a safe environment for our patients. Another big worry is the tracking of controlled drugs from ADD medication to opiates. Here, pharmacists say a strict fingerprint technology and two-person procedure tracks and secures the drugs to make sure they stay in the right hands. The robotics won't be seen by patients, but the hospital says behind the scenes they'll be working 24 hours a day. The most amazing pharmacy in Australia. It's the most automated pharmacy in Australia with its uh, robotics and it's a, it's a wonderful place to be.